This is Argentinette with Cooking Couture Atlanta. Hey, honey, look, I have the privilege and the pleasure of sitting down with people who have touched my life. I am today breaking bread over the gratitude board, and we are taking it, we're elevating it, taking it a little higher. It's King Day, we're celebrating, and I am here sharing a space with a homegirl from St. Louis. Y'all, she with the back. What's up? <laughs> we got the Lou in the house. But she does rep East St. Louis, so we'll forgive her for that. I'm from East St. Louis, guys. Hey, she I'm went to school Louis. on our side, though. <laughs> Listen, this is Brigitte. Say it right, boo. Don't say it wrong. It's like Sinet. Brigitte, <laughs> get it right. <laughs> we are really here. We got we got the charcuterie going on. Mm. And her last name is Ortiz. <laughs> so I wasn't trying to be funny, but I did do a Mexican fiesta dip. I did a homemade guacamole. And I did a uh, cheese queso dip. And then we got the chips and everything going on. But we are reviewing this Stella Rosa. It's a billboard by my house. And everybody has been, I've been seeing it on my timeline. Child, so we are, we, I thought I'd check it out. And I, you know me, I threw some glasses in the chiller. And <laughs> so we get ready to talk about this, but we get ready to toast. You we got a topic you want to toast to? Um, toast to women entrepreneurs. Oh yeah, she really on that. I am. We, so yes, she. Okay? <laughs> she is really on yes. that. And I mean, this is what this is the day on, but a day off. Mm -hmm. That's what they like to call King's yes. Day. It's a day off, but a day on. And we are we are here together making a commitment. A real mm -hmm. commitment. We ready to do some stuff. You, you all hear about it. Twenty twenty. Twenty twenty is it, yeah. and we gotta support each other. That's so right. we. This all about women entrepreneurs, and we gonna thank King in that, cause you know, because of the things and the sacrifices he did, and Rosa and all of them, mm -hmm. we can sit here mm -hmm. and we can toast and take a day off, mm -hmm. and but a day on to do. So let's look to women entrepreneurs. Yeah. You know, one more time for King. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. And let's see what's up with this. Well, you know we had to have a little pre-game toast before we turned the camera on. So I kind of knew what I was expecting. So you tell me what you think about it and how you rate this Stella Rosa wine. Well, it's sweet. It is definitely sweet, honey. And this is adult juicy juice. Really? I am really not yeah, into the sweet. I'm not I'm not a sweet girl. Um, I do like um that's the St. Louis dry, that I have. So I mean, this is a good starter, you know, when you in your early 20s and you're trying to do <laughs> right, something. Right, right, right. So I just think you're doing you something. Think you're doing something. Right. So this is cute. It's, cute. it's, it's like the um, adult version of Arbor Mist. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, if you really want to be grown, then you do this because you think you're doing something. Right. It, it's not Arbor Mist. It's not all that. But, child, honey, this is like a big old classy wine cooler. Yeah. With this 5% liquor in it. <laughs> you only got 5% liquor. I'll get home safely. Right. <laughs> she was like, well, let me see. I'm going to make sure I can get home, child. I'm going to get home. <laughs> we'll drink all of that. That's just like drinking juicy juice. Yeah, no, I know. You know what? It's like something that you would pair with. A California roll. You know, when you first start eating sushi, you think you're doing something with a California oh, roll. Oh, yeah. Cute. Oh, that's a good comparison. Oh, yeah. that's, that's what you would do. I forgot to mention that she's a State Farm agent. She's the bomb. She's our new agent. <laughs> she got a brand new office at uh, North Druid Hills in the Toco Hills Shopping Plaza, right next to Publix. Look upstairs. She right there. Don't play. But, <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, that's what this is. So, from one to seven, how many bottles of this do you think that you would have to right <laughs> see she with me i don't even need none of this this is cool if i go somewhere and somebody has it i'll be polite and take a glass right but i don't need none of this in, in my collection yeah you know what i mean yeah. now if somebody brings it over it's cool we'll do it it's not the worst because the worst goes in the hookah girl i found out about that you that's what the kids do with the cheap liquor instead of water in the hookah they put wine Girl, I didn't know that. My I'm daughter here. did it. I'm I know, here. right? But I'm getting you hip. I'm getting everybody yes, hip. Me. But I wouldn't put this in the hookah. So it's not that <laughs> it's bad. Not that right. bad. Right. <laughs> it's not that bad. That's that two, three dollar wine <laughs> from Kroger right. and, and uh, that Walmart wine. <laughs> that go in the hookah. This won't go in the hookah. But it's it was cool to toast to, to the women. Cool. You know, it's, yes. it's it's all good. It's cool. We gonna be all right. <laughs> but we ain't gonna buy no more. <laughs> right